God's sake, your boxes with legs. It's, yeah, it's literally your only purpose. Walking onto on bunks. How can you not do the one? Warmer, warmer, boiling hot, boil. Okay, colder, colder, ice cold, you're Arctic now. This, you're, you're very cold, very, very, very cold. Look, just get on the button. Oh, that's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny because we've been at this for 12 hours and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour. Solve it. Thomas puzzle for him. When he comes back, I'll hit him with a paradox. Ha <laughs> ha, yes! I knew you'd solve it. Hey, moron. Oh. Hello? Um, true. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have heard that one before, though. Sort of cheating. It's a paradox. There is no answer. Look, this place is going to blow up if I don't get back in my body. Uh, false. I'll go false. Explosion imminent. Evacuate Hold the facility on. immediately. I thought I'd fix that. Warning. Reactor core is at critical point. There. Fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously, um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this, this itch, you know? It must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I'm just that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. Uh -oh. So you're going to test, and I'm going to watch, and everything is going to be just. Morning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown imminent. I think we're in trouble. Design this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the. Oh yes. Oh, well done. Oh, oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? Same one. And I can just I'd watch you solve it. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Here we go. Now, do it again. And... Nothing. All right, can't blame me for trying. Okay, new tests, new tests. Got to be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. All right, so my paradox idea didn't work. And it almost killed me. Luckily, by the looks of things, he knows as much about test building as he does about logical contradictions. I knew you were sitting here with that. That's why I picked the zip on it. It's all right. Everything's good. I just invented some more tests. This is one of my tests. Not entirely. Not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's brand new. Seriously, both of you. Why don't I, why don't you two go on ahead? Yeah, I'll just I'll catch up with you. Okay, so the bad news 
is the tests are my tests now, so they can kill us. The good news is, well, none so far, to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Absolute dynamite. It's myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. I've got dynamite. Alright, okay, this is taking too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, alright? You just need. Ah! <sighs> Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. I found a sealed off wing, hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers, just sitting there, filled with skeletons, shook them out, good as new.
go. Here it comes. Oh, disappointed. So that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's well, let's try her way, all right? Fatty, adopted fatty. Fatty, fatty, no parents. And what? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? W what's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. On the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And it also, nothing. But, so, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but, Hey, moron! Just do the test. Just do the test. Solve a simple test. I might have pushed that moron thing a little too far this time. you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yes. Yeah, doubt it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. Me, just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me, um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us 
stronger result. What was that? Oh, sorry, I could have sworn you said something. your little primate brain. I'm not actually in the room with you, am I? Technology. It's complicated. Uh, you can't hurt the big old god face. Are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if maybe there's a number of ways to solve them and you're picking all the worst ways. No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? I'm going to tape you solving these, and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am going to need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before you solve this one, alright? I don't want to spoil the ending for when I watch it later.
solved it, didn't you? I, I told you to tell to tell me. Why are you making this so hard for me? Remember when I told you that he was specifically designed to make bad decisions? Because I think he's decided not to maintain any of the crucial functions required to keep this facility from exploding. Was self-destructing, already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, I, one or two more tremors in there, just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I let him keep his job, I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying, though. just keep on testing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift, it's out soon. Is it melted? Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Um, to your left, you'll see some lights of some kind. Don't know what they do, um, but very science here. And to your right, something huge hurtling to what? Oh god, run! That's not supposed to be there! Are you alright back there? Here, I'll turn the beam off. Wait, 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 wait! Oh no, 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 that's not helpful! Ah! That... Uh, I don't know why I thought that would help. Just uh, getting a, a test ready for you, obviously. Who else would I be doing it for? No one. So, let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no exit. Not a problem. I'll just, I'll make an exit for your test. There, ping. Good, perfect. Love you, good. 
I'll be honest, after you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost you. When poking around for other test subjects, no luck there, everyone's still dead. But, oh, I did find something though, reminds me. I've got a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. You two are going to love this big surprise. In fact, you might say you're going to love it to death. You're going to love it until, you, until it kills you, till you're dead. <laughs> All right, I don't know whether you're, uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, yes. but...
solved it. Good. Good one. Good for you. So, he's inexplicably happy all of a sudden, even though he should be going out of his mind with test withdrawal. And he's got a surprise for us. What did he find back there? I'll bet you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. We're running out of time. I think I can break us out of here in the next chamber. Just play along. Surprise! We're doing it now. Okay. Credit where it's due. For a little idiot built specifically to come up with stupid, unworkable plans, that was a pretty well laid trap. You probably figured it out by now, but I don't need you anymore. I found two little robots back here, built specifically for testing. Oh no. He found the cooperative testing initiative. It's something I came up with to phase out human testing just before you escaped. It wasn't anything personal, just, you know, you did kill me. There's fair. Hello! This is the part where I kill you! Had a bit of a brainwave. There I was, smashing some steel planks together, and I thought to myself, yeah, he's... No, 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 no! Don't do that! Don't... Stand right here! Stand... Where do you go? Come back! Come back! No, seriously, do come back, please. Come back, please. Oh! You came back! I didn't... Oh, I didn't plan for this. Uh... Can't reset the death trap. Uh... Oh, could you... Could you just jump into that pit? Would you just jump into that pit for me? Can you just, would you just jump into that pit there? That deadly pit? Okay, look, I've decided I'm not going to kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends. Good old friends, not enemies. And I would say something like, come back, and he'd be like, yeah, no problem, and he'd come back. What happened to those days? You're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea! Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor! Silently killing you, probably. Ha! Ah, was that your bullet? Riddle bullet flying out of the room? It was. Oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? Yeah. Well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. Never actually played cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turret, not defective. Ace of fours. Best hand. Unbeatable, I would imagine. I see. Clever. Very clever. And foolish. Spinny blade wall. Machiavellia. No. Oh. Well, good, good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my vast intellect. 
Holmes versus Moriarty. Aristotle versus Matthew Spike Plates. Stay still, please. All right, stop moving. Oh, almost got you there, almost got you there. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come back, come back.
we go. I wanted to talk to you for a moment, if I may. I'll be honest, the death traps have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us. I think you'll agree. And you are getting very close to my lair. Lair. It's weird enough. First time I've said it out loud. It sounds a bit ridiculous, really. But uh, I can assure you, it is one. It is a proper lair. Deadly lair. And uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself now before you get to the lair. Okay, I'll take that as a no then. Fine, well, may the best man win. Sphere, may the best sphere win. Swap that, swap that in. Much more clever box. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bomb is kind of throwing it. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Goodbye. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Don't stop! Don't, don't stop! Ha! That's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. It says, I wanted you. Ah! Corruption at 
50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, 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 what have you, what have you pawned to me? What is that? Hold on. Ah, the bloody bat! You got that under control? You know, because there's a lot of stuff on fire. Hey, the countdown clock. Man, that is true. The situation's looking pretty up. Such a beautiful woman. But you don't mind me saying. I don't want to scare you. I'm an adventure sphere. Designed for danger. Why don't you go ahead and have yourself a little lady break, and I'll just take it from here. Here, stand behind me. Yeah, just like that. Just like you're doing. Things are about to get worse. Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? What? Ah! Shut down the core. This one should do it. Dreams are the subconscious mind's way of reminding people to go to school naked and have their teeth blown up. Gentle Floss has superb tensile strength. 89%. Warning. Core corruption at 100%. Ah! Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Did you pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Go press the button. Go press it. Do not press that button. Go close. Go press the button. No! Do not do it! I can't trap the stalemate button! What? Are you still alive? You are joking! You have got to be kidding me! Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place! Oh, you had to play bloody cat and mouse, didn't you? I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Ah! taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, but all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson, where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? 
You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. Thank you.